this is Bernard again. Welcome to today's video. I will show you ways how to install Banked on your local computer. The first step is to download the executables. You can find the link in the description of this video. You can see that here we have the Banked executable for Mac, for Ubuntu and for Microsoft Windows. I will now download the Mac executable by pressing here on the download button. You have to save where to save the file, you know the drill. Now that the download was done, I can unzip the file and it will result in a new directory, executables Mac. Here we have banked, and here we can finally see the banked executable, 9 megabytes, of course, until you watch this video, the file sizes will change, and we can execute banked now, simply by double clicking on it. Once banked started, you will see the current path, there might be a test run selected, or you can choose one from the examples folder, but that we will cover in another video. So just a quick recap, we go to GitHub to download the zip file with the executables for our platform. We unzip to a local directory or folder, we navigate into there and we start the executable banked. Now we are good to try the examples in the examples folder. The prerequisite for you to be able to run banked on Docker is that you have Docker installed on your computer or wherever you want to run Banked in the Docker. I assume that you have it installed, so we can go to the repository, which is on GitHub, and download or clone the repository. You find here the link to the GitHub repository. You can download the zip or directly open it in the desktop. You will need to use the command line for Docker to run and download all the scripts. Once the download is finished, we will start executing the Docker script, which will take quite a long time on your computer, because Docker will have to load all the initial data for the first run. Once this is done, in every other run it will execute pretty fast. The command to start Docker to build everything is make build, in this directory where you downloaded the bank Docker image. You saw that it was pretty fast here, because I had done this before, in your computer, depending on your internet speed, it might take up to 30 minutes. The next command we enter is make run. After this command, we can see that he is starting a VNC server. And in our browser, we just enter VNC, localhost, and port is 5902. The password is password. You can see that Banked is already started inside the Docker container. And we can execute now a simple example here, which will basically run this example test case. You can see that Firefox opens inside the Docker, and all the commands that are part of this test execution script are executed. I will stop it right here because that's part of a different video to deal with the, with the test cases. Bank understands that we closed the browser and assumes that the test run is finished now. That was how to install Bank in the Docker container. Again, just a quick recap. When we want to use Docker for Banked, we go to GitHub, you will see the link below. We download the Docker script, we navigate into the download folder and we enter make build, which will take a long time, and make run. Then we go to our browser, go to VNC localhost port 5902 and we can try out the examples. For developers there are even more ways to install Banked. The first is to install the source code repository directly from GitHub with this link. 
and the second is to install from the Python package index where the command would be pip install banked. You will use this last method when you want to use banked as a base for a bigger project. That's it for this video. Don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more of our content.